Hi. Hi. Good morning. Good afternoon. How are you? Okay. How are your cards? Mo, do you listen? Not a lot. Not everything. <laughs> Uh, bago na yung ginagawa natin, ha? Yung G. G. That's it. That's yung D. D over F sharp. Ito nang gawin natin. Para umaatras ka lang. Okay. Where's your copy? Na, mayroon kang copy. Yan. Good. Use your thumb for your fourth string. Yan. Then, atras ka lang. Then, go backwards lang. So, your third finger will from from fifth, fifth fret punta siya sa Fourth fret. Okay, so fifth fret, fourth fret. Ang mag-iiba lang is your first and your second finger. Sa una ganyan sila hagdan. The next ay okay. You just gonna change their uh, strings. So, what you're gonna do, uh, Laisha, hindi mo na tatanggalin yung fingers na to. Lalo na yung third finger mo. Okay? She's, it's just gonna go back and forth. Sa, ano, sa, uh, sa verse. Sa verse ng song. Okay? Da, 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 da. Sige nga, can you do it? Then it's gonna change. Yes. Dito lang. Yan. Up. One ano lang ha. One. One fret. Yan. Tapos your. Ababa mo nga konte yung ano mo camera so I can see your hand. Yan. Better. There you go. So from from fifth fret. Yan. Gonna go like that? Yes, on the fourth fret, yung third finger. So everything uh, atras ng one fret lang. Okay, so that's your G. There you go. Tapos atras ka lang for F sharp. Then, but wait, but wait. Your first finger will go to the third string. Your second finger will go to the second string. Magpapalit lang sila. Yan. You get it now? There you go. That's your F sharp, uh, D over F sharp. There you go. Yes. Okay. Practice them again. Go back to G. Then go to F sharp over uh, D over F sharp. Go back to G naman. Don't remove your, ano na, don't remove your third finger. Yan. Ang mag, ano lang, mag-adjust is first and second finger.
good. Da, 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 da. Three, four. Da, 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 da. Ba, 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 da, ba, ba. Da, 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 da. Okay, pabalik-balik yun. I wait. Share my screen. tayo sa naka-G. So, ang gagamitin natin chords, tandaan mo, ha? G. Kasi yan ang, ano, ba? Basta na yun. <coughs> Nakapag-practice ba sa ano? Book. Mabalik tayo sa book konti ha. Saan na yung chords na ginagamit natin? Okay, ito. Tiny my picky. Three, four, one, two, three, four. So every chord, sa verse, ay merong four counts. So what we're gonna do, mag-ano lang muna tayo ha, mag, we're just going to strum once, then count for every chord sa kakalilipat after four sa kakalilipat sa next chord sa D over F sharp two three four D over F sharp two three four one two three four do it slowly two three four sige nga can you do it ganon mo na ganon yung dalawang chord lang yon yung 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 two chords lang na yon those two chords lang. So, those two chords, you will count four bago ka pumunta sa D over F sharp. Tapos balik ka sa G after four. So, four counts every chord. Where's your copy? Na nasa iyo ba yung ano mga screenshot? Tingnan mo yung screenshot mo. Hagdan lang, hagdan. From fourth string. Memorize sa Mas maganda, memorize. Para di ka natitingin lagi sa kopya mo. Fifth fret. Yan. Oh, 
Your third finger will be on your fourth string. Okay. Yan. Up oh, no 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 no. Wait, your second finger will be on the third string. For G. Sa G ka muna, ano, Lysha. Fifth fret. Yan. Hagdan. Ibig sabihin, uh, yan lang, oh, from fourth, third. Okay? Memorize, ha? Memorize natin yung chord natin. Kasi yan lang siya, oh. Oh, go. Four counts every chord. Sa kakalilipat. Strum once lang. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Go. Strum. D-shirt muna? No, no. G muna. That's your G. One, two. No, no. Strum one lang. Strum once lang. But you need to count four. You have to stay to, with that chord for four counts. You get it? So, one, two, three, four. Lipat ng chord. One, two. Yung nga. Go. I, want, I need you to count. I need you to say. Say it. So, after one strum. One, two, three, four. Lipat. This? Yes. Yan. Yung dalawang chord lang na yan. Two, three, four. Four. Lipat ulit. Balik ka sa G. One, two, three, four. Yan. Kaya, you don't need to remove your third finger. Kasi yan lang yan. But it hurts. Oo. Dahan-dahanin mo. Dahan-dahanin. Go. It will hurt. Actually, malambot pa yung strings mo. That's nylon eh. Do it slowly. Make sure you're in the right fret. Tingnan mo yung third finger mo. Yeah, practice muna ng ganyan. Just slide down, slide up. Yan. Four counts sa every chord. Sige, do it slowly. So, then, Lysha, yung one mo, yung first strum mo. One. Okay? Sorry. Yung first strum mo, yun yung one mo. One, two, three, four. One, two. Okay? Hindi pa rin pag strum mo, yung magwa one ka pa lang. Kasi sosobra ka ng count. So, the purpose, bakit ko pinapagawa ito? Kasi, uh, that's the, the value of your chord. That's how long the chord will stay sa song. Okay? Okay, go.
Now, Lysha. Memorize mo ba yung kanta? I mean, the the lyrics of the song. Kahit yung verse lang. Matay di maipiki So, kasi, since you like this song, di ba? Is this your favorite sa kanta nilang lahat? No. No? Anong favorite mo? You, the, anong mas favorite mo na kanta? Ano yun? Araw-araw. Araw-araw. Oh, I like araw-araw dun. Maganda naman mga songs nila actually. Lahat ng songs nila maganda. Iba-iba ang ano, theme. Okay, anyway. Uh, so, yan. Tingnan mo dito sa lyrics. Ha? How do you use this kind of uh, platform ng, ng lyrics na may chords? Pansinin mo to. The G is not on the uh, sa on the top of mata sa lyrics. Mm-hmm. You notice ha? Kasi you first you will first play G before saying the lyrics matay. Ibig sabihin, 'di ba? You're gonna play G first. Matay di maipiki. So, ibig sabihin, Laisha, the chords, the, the, the use of this chords, bakit sila nasa tapat ng mga parts ng words? Example, maipikit. Nandito na siya sa kit. Right? Because dyan mo na siya ipli-play. Yan yung bilang niya. So, when you say, uh, kaya pinagbibilang kita ng 1, 2, 3, 4, 1. Matay di maipi 4 2 Ganyan ang bilang mo 2 3 4 Matay di maipi 2 3 4 ka na iisit 2 3 4 utak ni lalaro 2 3, 4 Hukis ng puso ko 2, 3, 4 Do you get it? Okay Laisha, I need you to do it again Do you sing? Mm. Come on, try I don't sing Tagalog oh, Sige, it's okay oh, Sige, ako ang gagawa Count four counts sa every chord. One one strum lang ha, one strum lang. One strum lang. Go. And hold the chord ha, hold the chord when you strum. Sabihin pag strum mong ganyan, wag mong bibitawan yung chord for four counts. Okay? Go. Tay di maipiki. Up, up, careful. Fourth string. Yeah, yan. Two, three, four. Go to G. Balik sa G. Di ka na iisip. Go back to F sharp. Two, three, four. Go back to G. Utak ni Lala Rogo Bakhtadi. Two, three, four. G ulit. Ugis ng puso ko. Balik ulit. And there you go. That's your first verse. <laughs> yun lang yun. Try it, ah. Just need to count four counts every chord. Sa kakalilipat. Okay? Upo ang magtatabi. Ha? Ito na pala yung mayroong pang A major. Upo ang magtatabi. Merong mahulugan. Kaibigan ang pag-ibig. Ano bang naramdaman? 
So, sa, sa verse 2 kasi, mayroon ng uh, bagong chord. So, instead of G, it will be A, then D over F sharp, then may G. So, nagiging tatlo. Nadagdagan. Nadagdagan yung ano. Alright? <laughs> Are you okay? <coughs> Okay, babalikan natin yan mamaya ha. Punta muna tayo sa book natin para ma-practice ang individual fingers natin. Okay, ito, Laisha. Let's do this. Itong guitar rock na to. So, this includes second, first and second strings. Sige nga. Look at your count sa sa ano. Wait. Go. Careful. Make sure your thumb is properly ano ha, at the back. Para may strength yung ano mo. And go. Take slowly. The four good. Good job. Next style. What for man? So we are on three four game. Okay, good. Uh, now I need you to do this. Can it Remember that you need to uh, s let your first finger stay. Okay, so let your first finger stay. Kung papunta ka sa third fret, let your first finger stay there. Okay, para pag dating mo dito, so you're on the third fret, tas punta ka sa first fret, remove lang yung third finger mo. Okay. Tapos andun na yung first finger mo. So, ang, ang, ang point is, hindi masyadong umaangat yung fingers mo. So, ganito lang siya. Can you see? Can you see my hand ba? You can see, ah. Okay. Ang difference, ganito. Okay. Unstable kasi pag masyadong nasa taas yung mga fingers, lahat nandun sila. Okay? Mas maganda, nandun lang sila, malapit. Okay? One more time. Wait. Go. Two, 
job. Better. Diba? It's better kasi when, uh, pag ginagawa mo kasi sa wait lang. Stop short. So, ang nangyayari kasi when you play, pag masyadong malayo ang fingers mo, nandito sila lagi. O kaya, ganyan. Vice versa. Unstable. Unstable. So, pag andyan sila, tsaka it will take time pa para lumapit siya ulit. It will always take time. So, it's better it's there. Or not do uh, not uh, taking out it the first finger, okay? Not yan lang siya. Don't need to put it up na unless you need the open string. So kailangan mo tanggalin talaga. Is my guitar too loud? Di naman. Di naman mahina. Okay, good. Okay, always remember that, ha? Yung fingers is very important. Playing smoothly. Skip natin yung jingle bells kasi malayo pa Pasko. <laughs> Skip natin dyan. So, okay. Ang, ang, ang purpose ko talaga ay ma-stable muna yung hands. Fingers mo. Okay. Let's start with this one. Are you ready? You have third string na dito again. Kasi last time nag-third string tayo. Medyo nahirapan pa tayo. Bila babalikan lang natin. Okay? Third string, first string, second string na yan. Okay, go. Good job. Hmm, memorize mo na ata to eh. Oh, ito, go. Remember to put your fingers down long. Yeah. First string. Okay. <laughs> One more. One more then. Okay, 
good game for comes also review lang to ha review para mas stable yung hand very good repeat may repeat sign ka good Zero three, one, three, zero. Two, three, four. Good. Better, right? It gets better. Okay, tandaan maha yung repeat sign natin. Example yan. So, kung asa ng repeat sign mo, doon ka babalik. Example for this one. Then, after you repeat, saka ka de Let's move. Let's move. Come on. Let's go here. Or put down your first finger lagi ha. Good. Two, three, four. Ayan na yung chords natin. Tapos na tayo dito actually. Nag-review tayo. Kasi last time nga, sabi ko, hindi pa ready yung hands mo. Okay, so first chord. Open G and B strings. So, open G is the third string. Okay? Skip nga natin yan. Dito tayo. Three note chords on the open G, B, and E string. So, ayan. These three open strings are already a chord. So, ang chord na to ay uh, G, B, E. Chord na yan. Okay. Next. Same. This chord is an E minor chord. Yes. Yung tatlo lang na yan. Pag pinagsabay mo sila, when you play it together, Okay. That's an E minor chord. E, 
G, B. Can you do this first? Nga muna? Can you play it for me? Ito lang. Use your uh, thumb, first finger, and third finger para dito. Sabay, sabay. Plak. There you go. Ito na, meron na tayong bawang chord, C major. Okay. This one, itong C na to, uh, three, three strings lang. Okay, ready? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Three, four, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, go. Last to last. Tapos meron akong listening para sa'yo. Okay, go. Count. One, two, job. Naalala mo ang anong tawag natin dyan? Dotted half note. Dotted half note have uh, three counts. Okay. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Sige. Rest your hands muna. Rest. <laughs> Masakit. Pero, uh, kasi three times a week ka naman. So, bali, ito ang parang practice mo na din talaga to Every after ba nagpa-practice ka din naman? Kinda. Be practice, kinda. <laughs> kasi three times a week ka. So, bali, marami kang... Okay, uh, I want you to watch this. Ito. Forgot your name. Mm. There you go. I want to watch this little girl. The reason why, kasi, she is also playing the guitar. Then, also, uh, she is using a classical nylon guitar. Okay? Classical guitar. Ang gamit ng batang to. 
Okay, can you see this? No, no, wala yung camera mo. I'm still there. Yeah. Hi. Okay. She's six years old. Six years old long she. Look at her small little hands. Lalo na yung left hand niya. So maybe this little girl started very very young age. Kasi 6 years old lang siya dyan. Magaling na yung hands niya. And she is really a great guitarist na ngayon. <laughs> Pero maliit pa rin siya. I mean, young pa siya hanggang ngayon. So yun. Great example. Ito. Small kids. Listen to this one. This one also, this, li this boy started at a young age. The boy is playing the ukulele. started playing the ukulele also this young then now he's playing the guitar already so next start to say ukulele mm -hmm. yes okay some inspirations okay. the, i want you to watch this do you know jacob collier are you familiar no not familiar J.C. Collier is a multi-instrumentalist and a genius. Okay, I want you to watch this. So he plays different instruments. Basta marami instruments. He plays different and not usual instruments minsan. Okay. So inspiration, this this boy naman he started also in a young age so yan malaki siya ngayon he's uh, maybe he's on his 20s then genius level ang kanyang music i know uh, music knowledge niya <laughs> okay he sings he plays everything he do music productions very very genius listen to this one Two-time Grammy winner. How's that feel? That's kind of strange, actually. <laughs> yeah, I mean, 
Jacob Collier. Now, before you perform, Jacob, Jacob Collier. I want everybody to know you're just one guy, Listen. and there's so many instruments here. Can you, can Listen you show up. everybody how, how you're going to do yes, what I you're going to do? So this is essentially like I've rebuilt the room at home okay. in a big circle. We've got percussion, we've got drums, we've got keyboard, we've got harmonizer, which is like a vocal synthesizer, uh, which I invented from scratch with this guy Benjamin Bloomberg at MIT. Um, this is a bass with a bear on it. And then there's <laughs> another bass there and a guitar, which I'm holding. Okay. Um, and essentially what happens is that I play something on one instrument and then I walk away from the instrument and that keeps playing. Okay. And so by the end of the loop, you have multiple Jacobs at one time, maybe four or five. Everybody understand the process? Okay, now Kay. he's going to So he's going to play all of the instruments Jan sa harap niya. Okay? So lahat, the guitar, the piano, the drums, the bass, everything in front of him. And it will keep on looping. Okay? Ibig sabihin, it will be recorded and it will just keep on playing. Hanggang sa mabuo. Siya lang mag-isa. Okay? Sige, watch. Process here to perform a medley. Grammy winner Jacob Collier. Listen to it. Look at her, his feet. That's the bass. Boom, boom. We're playing the guitar. Everybody near and far. Come together as one. Go to the ocean, to the sky. Bass, contrabass. Get bass guitar. recorded everything will be recorded listen it's there it will keep on playing it's what we call looping Everything that you are hearing now, Don't you worry Grabbing energy, yeah. No. <laughs> what can you say about the artist? Um. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Different. Can you see my cat? My cat is so cool. Anyway, yon. Jacob Collier. Should try to listen to his songs also. Magaling siya. Genius level. So, alam mo, uh, that's, uh, kaya naisip ko rin pa rinig sa um, the, the reason why is, what about Ben and Ben? Ben and Ben is a big band. Not the usual band na uh, the bass guitar, the electric guitar, so, so uh, I think they listen to Jacob Collier then. They have this kind of... Because the Ben and Ben, there are a lot of 
pinapakinggan na artist then so may parts din na they 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 they, they paano ba ibig sabihin they sound like somebody okay so yan Ben and Ben since yun nga ang and sino pinaka favorite band mo ngayon favorite band Uh, no, no? Sorry? Ben and Ben talaga. Pero magaling sila. Napanood mo na ba sila live? Not yet? Yeah. You should. Kaso, yun nga, it's pandemic na. Huh? I like the Beatles and the Beatles. And? And Queen. Queen? Wow, nice, nice. Oh. Nice. Ano ba? Uh, Beatles. Yeah, pwede ka rin mag Beatles na songs. They have uh, nice songs and uh, simple chords na meron ng ano, meron ng sample nito. Uh, ito. Yan. You know this song? Ano yung title nito? Come Together. Yan, paulit-ulit lang yan. Sunod yan. Paulit-ulit lang yan. Tapos bumababa. Yan, madaling aralin din yan. Beatles, Queen. Medyo, ano. Kasi, oh, ang Queen naman, ano eh. Paano ba? Glam Rock. Yun. Queen. Favorite song ng Queen? Uh, I forgot the song. <laughs> Fair before I like. Oh, wait. Let me switch for you. Kasi it's new. Uh-huh. Ano yan? Another one bites the dust. Another one bites the dust. Yan. Another one bites the dust. Yan. Pwede mo aralin yan. E minor. So, pero kailangan muna natin, ano ah, practice muna yung chords doon, yung mga ganun. Ito, pwede mong gawin ito eh. <laughs> Six string lang, yung E lang, meron ka ng another one bites the dust. Okay, anyway, yun. Some inspirations naman sa mga artist para hindi ka ma-bored dun sa ating book. Kasi, yun nga, uh, mahirap kasi mag, uh, uh, mahirap kasi bigla tayong pupunta sa mataas na level. So, mangyayari, mahihirapan yung hands natin. So, uh, ayoko naman mangyari na sasakit sobra yung hands mo. Okay? So, I need you to practice your chords. Kahit yun lang muna. Pabalik-balik. Okay? Tapos, di ba, meron ka ng A major chord? Maganda din ang song na Araw-Araw. Yun ang pinaka-favorite mo sa Ben and Ben. Araw-Araw. Yeah. <laughs> gusto ko rin yan. Ah, gusto ko yung mga kanta nila. Gusto ko rin ang... Uh, 
gusto ko rin ang ano nga first we have grammarly uh, the ano nga song na to dami bang gusto ng sambihi yun ngunit wag na lang muna lang sila din yung sa video ng ano di ba sila din yung nasa video na isang song no uh, pagtingin right sila din yan sa pagtingin hmm, ginawa nila ng ano pala to naman ang chords nito. Maganda talaga if ever you want to play songs kagad ng songs nila. Maganda may mayroon kang kapo. So, ganito. Mayroon ganito ang klaseng kapo. Ito itsura niya. Have you seen one? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, kapo. So, kasi yung guitar mo, mas malapad ang ano niyan, ang fret, ang fretboard. So kailangan pag if ever bumili ka ha, tandaan mo sabihin mo ang ang gitara mo ay classical guitar. Kasi baka bigyan ka ng uh, the usual, minsan kasi maikli, maikli. So you need a uh, a uh, capo that is mas mahaba. Okay. Da 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 Yan, madali ang chords niyan if ever mayroong kang ano, mayroong kapo kasi it will be easier instead na you're done do this magiging A So anyway, since it's already time, so then it all. Lisha, practice on your book, ha. Practice pa rin sa book. Wag mong iwanan yung book mo, wait. Kasi yan ang magpapatibay don sa fingers mo individually. Ito ang papatibay sa fingers mo. So practice until. Saan tayo natatapos? Actually, dito, nandito na tayo, di ba? We're here na eh. Meron na tayong tatlong chords eh. Can you practice until this page? Until here. Sorry, can you hear my dogs? So, practice until 25. Track 25. What page pa? Kasi kaya mo na ito. Ayot ah, to. Practice until the fourth string. 
track 27. Okay? Hanggang dito ah, track 27, 28. Alright? Sorry. Okay. I'll see you next week. Since it's Friday. Practice your chords, please. Memorize it. Okay, Lysha? Mas maganda memorize. Para hindi ka natingin-natingin. Okay? I'll see you. Bye-bye.